I've already opened this Jupyter Notebook and I'm ready to start writing code in the cells. But before I do that, I want to point out a couple of things here. First of all, down here in the lower right corner, this thing which looks kind of like a pig head to me, but I guess it's supposed to be a co-pilot with goggles. Um, this shows me that GitHub Copilot is operating in my notebook. In the upper left corner, this is where I would select the kernel that I want to run. So right now it can't run code because it doesn't have a kernel, but I'm going to go ahead and skip that because when I try to execute the first cell, it will give me an opportunity to select the kernel. When I'm using GitHub Copilot, the best way to get it to make a suggestion is to start off by giving a descriptive comment of what I want to have it do. So I'm going to put a pound sign here and then say assign a string to a variable. Now when I hit enter, I got some suggestions here. Okay, this is like pretty useless. Um, let's see what happens if I hit tab the type of the okay this is all useless garbage okay I don't know why it's doing that so I'll have to do it the old-fashioned way and actually write the code myself so I'm gonna create a variable name let's call it um, my underscore variable okay now it's suggesting to assign hello world to that variable. So all I have to do is hit the tab key and there I have it. Now it is um, suggesting maybe that I want to print the variable. That's not actually what I want to do. I want to print the length of the string. Okay, great, it's suggesting that. I'll hit tab. Now it says print len my variable. That's exactly what I wanted to do. So I will go ahead and do that. That's all the code that I need. Now when I click the run button, um, it's not actually doing anything. That's because up in the top it wants me to select a kernel source. I'll just click on Python environments and here's the recommended one. I'll click on that. Now you can see the little clock is running, it's pending, so it's basically spinning up the notebook and getting it started. Now it ran, and here's the um, answer, 11. So is that right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. That's correct.